me. Can you please pick me up outside the loft and take me to the hospital? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I could do that. What? Okay, sorry. No, what, what? What are you doing? Oh, the hospital needs me. Jake. I'm sorry, baby. That was Angie, wasn't it? It was, yeah. You cannot be the only doctor on call. Well, no, but she's actually helping me out doing another truth. By keeping you on 24-7 alert. Honey, you got to understand that David came on. He's looking to get rid of us in the worst way possible. So we figure the more hours we put in, you know, the more indispensable we become. And more exhausted. Well, yeah, but that's why we're working together, you know? I take care of her. She takes care of me. I want to take care of you. Oh, baby, you do. You do take care of me. I love you so Oh, I know we should take care of me. Mm. All right. Well, I got to go now. I'll be back. And I love you. I love you. See you soon. Mm. I won't be long. Don't. I need those pieces. Dr. Belden, tell me the results on the phone. Well, you, wait a second. You like to deal with your patients face to face. Well, right? he sounded grim. Don't do that. Don't always expect the worst. No, it's, it's more than that, Jake. I mean, I've been feeling a little off. But the meds have been working, right? Well, the periods of vision loss have been fewer and shorter since I've been taking the triazole meds. Have you been experiencing any side effects that I don't know about? Constant headache. I'm exhausted. Queasiness. Mm, I think that's just the stress. Where are we meeting this guy? In one of the private consultation rooms. Right. This way David won't bother you. Well, Dr. Belden, he uh, understands my need for privacy. Good. Lead the way. You don't have to come with me. But I didn't really come down here. To... No, I'm not letting you face the music alone. Let's go. Show me. sound urgent. Now it keeps me waiting. Well, the desk said he had a patient emergency. It's going to be fine. Come on in. Hey, Harold. I didn't hey, expect Jake. to see you, Jake. Yeah, well, you know. How are you, Angela? Can I tell you in five minutes? Perhaps you'd rather Dr. Martin wait outside? No, yeah, sure, I can... no, no. Uh, I I'm fine with him staying. So I um, told you that the symptoms seem to have abated. The peripheral vision is better. I haven't been taking the triazole drugs for long, but something's happening. Yes, the triazole drugs appear to be helping. That's that's great, right? So the culture test shows, shows that the infection attacking the retinal cells has slowed down significantly. There was something else that came up on your blood test results. Jesse. Your HCG is elevated. By how much? According to the blood test, your beta level is at 425. Whoa. That usually means you're... baby. That's what the test results indicate. I can't, I can't believe it, Jake. I know. I'm, I'm... So, Doc, how far along are we exactly? For conception dating, we need an ultrasound at five to six weeks gestation. Right. Do, do you remember last month when I, when I told you that I thought yeah, I was? Yeah, but you weren't. And, and now I, I am. You should I'm make a... an appointment to see your OBGYN as soon as possible. Yes. Because of your age and the infection, more tests should be done right away. The infection... The uh, experimental drugs that I've, I've been taking, could they hurt the baby? Well, Doc, wait, if I, if I may, the infection is localized, so it really it shouldn't, it shouldn't cause a risk, right? Correct, but if you plan on going to term with this pregnancy, I'd have to recommend you stop taking the medications right away. Hey. You okay? Okay, Jake, I, I'm blessed. I, I, 
I didn't think I'd ever be pregnant again. I know, it's amazing. But why now? But I, 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 I need this medication that could hurt the baby. Jake, what if I already hurt the baby? Step into my office. Now, you heard Dr. Belden, right? He said the baby is going to be fine, most likely, because you haven't been taking the meds for very long. But if I stopped taking it, I could go blind permanently. I mean, that's what's been happening to me before I started on Listen the meds. To me. You don't have to. You don't have to figure this all out right now, okay? Well, there is one thing that I do have to do right now. I have to tell Jesse the truth. Yes, yes, I've been wanting you to do that the whole way along. Oh, Jake, like, how do I drop this on him at once? Oh, please, Jesse's Jesse. He's strong. You need him. He needs you. Together, you'll figure it out. Right? Huh? You too. Are impossible to hunt down. <laughs> Kids, what are you doing here? Well, first, tell us if you're finished with your emergency, because it looks like you are. Yes, yes, we're finished with our emergency. Good, because we are here to rescue you both, and you don't get a vote. Is that right? That is right. You've taken care of enough sick souls for one night. Now it's my turn to take care of you. Come on, you. <laughs> this is so much better than working all night. There we go. Wine for all? Uh, none for me, thanks. Oh, come on, just a glass, baby. I mean, we have juice or uh, um, soda, to, don't we? And this is your favorite wine. Come on. Uh, uh, I, I don't want any, baby. Angela, I want to make a toast, okay? Why are you being so persistent? I don't want any wine. All right, you don't want any wine, you won't have any wine. Uh... Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I overreacted. It's, it's just, just been a long day. Yeah, but we have sparkling water, don't we? I think we have a whole case of it. I love sparkling water. With a splash of cranberry, because we can toast to that. I'm, I'm fine. You gotta be careful about turning down wine, Angie. People are gonna start thinking you're pregnant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, a baby? Baby, are you? Are you? I'm pregnant. <laughs> a baby. For real this time? Mm -hmm. A baby. You, you got the test and everything? Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love you so much. It's the best news, isn't it? Great news. It's great news. <laughs> oh, my God. This is... This is crazy. I mean, uh, miracle, kind of like miracle crazy, right? I mean, last time we thought we were and we weren't, and now we are. Mm -hmm. how, how, how far along are you? We? Well, I don't know exactly. Well, how long have you known? I, I just found out today. <laughs> you believe this? Congratulations. Uh, I can just, I can hug, wait a minute, I can hug the whole world. Come oh, oh, congratulations. Uh, oh, my God. Wait, this is, this, okay, it's not a dream, right? Somebody pinch me, pinch oh, me. No, no, it's not a dream. We are definitely having a baby. <laughs> oh. 